Hey guys, so we uh, we got the whole front end pulled off. We got the bumper over there. We got the front taken out. Uh, we've been uh, trying to figure out where to put this uh, this battery heater uh, that we're modifying this Model 3 with. So what we've decided to do is uh, we, we're using a Model S uh, bracket with a 1500 uh, watt zero uh, start uh, circulation tank heater. And so what our plan is, is we figured out that this is going to be the best location to let this fit to give it a factory OEM look. So now we need to drill and uh, secure this. So what we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to rip everything off here uh, so that we can get the, uh, the holes in our alignment for this bracket. Uh, and then we're going to go and drill and tap uh, this, uh, this beam right here, this aluminum beam, and, uh, and then start routing the uh, coolant hoses uh, to the circulation tank heater. Which is all the way back there. So this pipe right here, this assembly that we have uh, taken off this pipe, that's this whole pipe right here. Uh, these are the inputs, uh, the coolant in to the battery. Um, so we are gonna pull these clips, disconnect this hose, where uh, this right here is going to be the coolant in going to the heater and the return going back to this uh, to this hose right here. This is where the the warmed coolant is going to come through. The uh, coolant pump, if you can hear that uh, slight hum, uh, that hum is the coolant pumps uh, pretty much continuously working. That will help us to uh, circulate that coolant throughout the, co the car and uh, warm the whole system up. So now we're going to uh, start mo mocking up and mounting the, uh, the heater and running the hoses before we disconnect this. This Once we disconnect these, it is going to spill a lot of coolant everywhere. So we want to do this quick and efficiently. So this is where we're at. This is just uh, testing out um, sizing and location. So we routed right above all that and that's pretty much where the hose will uh, attach to in the back. Pretty much have the heat tubes all routed. Now we're just gonna have to plug in that to the manifold and then those two uh, outlets into the battery pack. All right, three, two, one. Mine's not even going. Oh, that's it. Mine's not unplugging. Oh, it's like, it's, it's just like shit. Come on. Oh, there's a. Well, I thought there was gonna be a lot more liquid than that. Oh. Wow. So I guess it is closed off then. It's the battery at the moment. There we go. Yeah, so that really just locks in. Um, okay, so we might want to now plug in the battery, the low voltage, and I'll let this bleed.
Circulation tank heater is all done, installed, and we already had coolant running through it. And we also made sure that we vacuumed the system. And then you want the coolant to be topped off at this super bottle, Tesla. And the underneath, you can tell the split between the two sides, the battery, and then the right hand side. Now it's just time to put everything back on.